welcome to town. Take a look around. Now, sir, put the money in my hand right now. Cause right now's the time for that roulette. Spinning and talking, walking the women till I'm up and in it. Using a pinch and a passion, rolling right up in the center with the dash blowing on until they say I'm the winner. If you dig it, dug it, wind a black jacket, slipped in my black stack of chicks for 25%. I'm sorry. I know I just misled you with the titling of this video. Eh. So do all the other people on YouTube. But I hope you understand. In case you need a reminder, live free or die, motherfuckers. Hello, YouTube. I am going to. Look, don't hit on the glasses. My eye. I'm starting to get a lazy eye. It's bothering me. Plus, this helps with the light. Anyway, here I am back. And i probably titling this thing something like uh, Part 2 of the Grow Room Remodel Teaser. Why? Because, hey, I just figured something out on my computer. Um, and I need to tell you a little update, a quick update, and ask for your patience. So... I figured out how to use my computer, what I'm using right here, for audio and video at the same time. And that's fucking easy because when I'm done, like when I do it in front of my desk, I have to get three fucking cameras and the audio, put it all together and whatnot. This, I just have the video. I can throw it up real easy on YouTube. And I realized, I thought for a second, hey, maybe I can do like a little check-in every day. And then I was like, oh shit, I need to check in and let you know what's going on. Why? Because you're probably expecting, the two, 300 of you that watched part one are expecting a part two. Well, I want you to know that I filmed all of it. The grow room is done. It's not as good as I wish it would was, the air conditioner anyway, but I got the fucking air conditioner in. I had to do it myself and it's gonna be a hell of a long process to edit those videos by myself. Now I was hoping to get the remodel done, edit the videos and get them out before I started working on my course and then film the course. But guess what, people? I'm scheduled to start filming November 2nd, 3rd and 4th. Um, and I got a lot of work to do. So I can't, and I'm here telling you, I've got them filmed. I will put them together and I will walk you through step by step as soon as we're done filming the class and I don't have to put so much work into that and I can get those done. I also have a, a handful, I, I think I have what, six total videos there. So part one through six, six part one through six, um, we've got uh, part one we've already done. Part two would be the wall prep. I think part three had its own. FRP, teach you how to put up FRP and why and how and where. Um, four would have been, was for the uh, AC, maybe, installing the AC. So maybe five, I don't know, I don't remember exactly, but all that stuff. We're going to break it up and you're going to enjoy it and that'll be there, but I ain't getting paid for that. So it'll come when it comes. Now, I also have a handful of these highway rants that a couple of you have watched and enjoyed and I actually enjoy those to help get my thoughts out and I literally have four of them done and mostly edited but I still don't have time to finish them and get them out so I was hoping that I could get all that done and then start working on the course but now it's time to work on the course so I gotta stop all that shit and I just wanted to let you know please be patient Oh, it's going to be worth it when you get to the course. Even if you already, you're a badass, you're the baddest fucking grower there is. Um, maybe I'll hook you up. Some, A lot of you have already paid for the course. A lot of you have already earned the course. Um, I had a guy out there that may be watching this that helped me. He knows HVAC. He's an HVAC technician. And I called him literally the day I'm trying to turn my unit on because I didn't know what the fuck to do and he really helped me out and I was like dude thank you I will um give you a free uh access to my course which may be worth 300 bucks who knows we'll see but then um why was I saying that so all of you that have already paid that have fuck me I am gonna have to edit this 
<laughs> this shit happens to me all the time. It takes about 15 seconds, so give me a break. I actually don't know what the fuck I was doing, and I'm going to stop this and watch it. All right, I remember what it is. So I was saying, even if you're a badass, you're going to enjoy this course. I'm putting everything I got into it. And you may learn a few tricks, but it's going to be entertaining. It's not going to be your conventional approach. And whatever my style is, I'm going to bring it to the highest level. And if anything, it'll, it'll be entertaining. And if you learn something, cool. But if you're a beginner, it's going to be worth thousands of dollars to you in terms of being able to get off on the right foot and not make mistakes, et cetera, et cetera. So good things come to those who wait. Keep waiting on me. Wish me luck. Um, I wanted to say that, hey, I set this shit up to practice my videos. And as I did it, I was like, hey, this will be a cool thing to do for um, uh, YouTube, an easy way to get the videos up so here's this one maybe i'll come back with some updates and we'll call these you know something that's not really a video newscast Flockawatt's newscast that's what we'll call it because i can talk shit about other things for, you know 10 minutes a day and maybe you'll enjoy that and if you do leave a comment smash the like button Fuck that shit. I hate it when people say smash the like button. You're using a fucking computer. You're moving different colored pixels to different colored pixels. You're not smashing anything. Do not activate the like button. Unless you like this video. That's how it works. And the way you activate it is with a mouse and a cursor. Don't smash it. Definitely subscribe because that number makes me feel happy. And comment because I want to talk shit. I don't mind talking shit. Uh, but positive comments are cool too. And what's the other one? Click the bell? Fuck the bell. I don't do anything with notifications. The only notifications I get on my phone are text. You can turn them all off. Turn them all off. Turn the fucking notifications on YouTube off. They're still going to send you whatever the fuck they want to send you. Not just because you subscribed or you're only getting those videos. It doesn't work that way. Anyway, that's advice to me. I hope it helps. And we'll see you on the next one again. Thanks for being patient. If you want to talk shit to me directly, write flocko at flockowats.com. Um, Till next time. Bye now. Let's go to Vegas.